What's going on everyone? I'm back here with another unboxing video and today I'm going to be unboxing the My Passport uh, one terabyte portable hard drive uh, for Mac. Um, I picked this up from my local Office Mac store for about $70, about $75 after tax. Um, that is uh, a sale price, so it's currently on sale for $70. Uh, the original price is about 90 uh, before taxes, so if you are in the market for this particular hard drive or anything like that, I would suggest um, getting to your local Office Max or ordering it online uh, right now because that sale price will not last very long. Uh, and it, you're getting about $20 off the original price, which is actually really good. So, yeah. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a quick look at the box here. So there's the front, shows you a quick picture of the device itself. Uh, this side get, shows you compatibility with what devices you can use. Uh, this just shows the side, contents. The back here just gives you some overall insight to the actual hard drive and what you can do with it. And then the bottom shows barcodes and or serial numbers. So, um, yeah, now it can be used with a Windows PC um, but it will require reformatting so if you want to use it with your Windows uh, PC you'll need to uh, go through a reformatting process which shouldn't take too long it should only take a couple minutes to complete um, but yeah uh, so let's go ahead and uh, get into this so let's see how we get into this so got a piece of tape right there there we are and it lifts up like so. Uh, and this is also a USB 3.0 hard drive as well. So it will work with uh, the USB 3.0 configurations uh, that are going on nowadays. And there's nothing else in the box. Okay. So, yeah, you're going to get some pretty decent transfer speeds, which is nice. And it also is backwards compatible with USB 2.0 as well. So if you have a Mac or a Windows PC that does not have USB 3, uh, you can easily uh, use it with USB 2. So that's another nice aspect of this hard drive. So here it is. Uh, it's actually really, really thin. Um, very compact, actually. Um, pretty surprising, actually. I was expecting it to be slightly thicker than what it actually is. So that's, this is actually something you could probably easily fit in your pocket or a little handbag or something like that. So... Really good in, in terms of um, portability, so that's really nice. Um, next up, we have the basically the setup guide on how to get uh, moving with this hard drive and what you need to do to reformat it and everything like that. Uh, this is just a quick start guide here, showing you how to plug it in, set it up, and um, getting the security software all set up and ready to go. And then this is just the warranty guide and product information and whatnot. So that's not a big deal there. Okay, then lastly, we have the USB 3.0 cable uh, that, of course, you use to transfer data. Um, so, as you can see, you have a standard USB on one end, and then you have... I'm not entirely sure what connector this is. It may be proprietary, but I'm not entirely sure, so don't quote me on that. But yeah... So the this in here you just plug into the hard drive. Let's see. Okay, there we go. Plug it in that way, and you're good to go. So basically, it's a plug and play type of situation. You just plug it in, and essentially, you can immediately start transferring data to and from the, your new hard drive. So really nice, um, really nice and compact. Now you can get this in multiple colors. Uh, this one happens to be the silver and or gray color. Uh, but you can also pick it up in blue, and I believe you can also pick it up in red as well, So, but I'm not entirely sure. But I know for sure you can get it in blue. So, that's pretty cool. Um, so that's basically it of this unboxing video. Um, hope you guys have enjoyed. Uh, make sure to hit the subscribe button right down there. Uh, it helps me out quite a lot. Um, also, hit that like button. It's also much appreciated. It lets me know that you guys are enjoying my videos. And so, yes, uh, if you guys have any questions or comments or anything like that, leave those in the section below, and I'll get back to them as soon as I can. Um, so that's basically it. Uh, once again, hope you guys have enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.